time. I need more energy. I'm not ready.
That was not bad. Thanks. Thank you. Yes. Are you sure? Fortune awaits.
to recharge. It's time to recharge. Need 
more time. to recharge. is done.
I wondered what happened to that shipment. Guess a reward is in order. Can't run an inn with nothing to feed lodgers. Well, if it isn't the Desert Wanderer, no worse for wear, I see. The drink I owe you will have to wait. I don't suppose you saw an old woman in the street outside just now, did you? No. Hmm. A friend was supposed to meet me here. I worry that she may have been detained. It's risky to show my face on the street with all the knights out there. Could you have a look around for me? Her name is Suna. Old woman, white hair. Where's an orange scarf? Leave it to me. We've got a shipment leaving for Skobos in a fortnight. I deal in Kazrak lands, but some of my stock spoiled. Now I'm short. Have to get more, or I'll be belly up in the bay. Musk Market is ruthless. Luckily for me, some Kazra just wandered from the south. And now I have you. Just cut the glands out, and I'll do the rest. Let's see. Ah, now that's the good stuff. Just the kick my scorpion wine needs. Stuff's not for the faint of heart. As promised, your reward. My recipe for an antidote. If my wine knocks you out, here's the fix for the morning after. <laughs> seen this since my youth. I tracked a goblin, hoping it would lead me to the realm of endless riches. Didn't know the damn bugger was really following me. <laughs> Knocked me on the head and stole my gold tooth. <laughs> Here is a reward for your service. Old Ostaf pays his debts. I know who you mean. She's been living here some years, one of those who barely made it out of Alcanus, if, um, if memory serves. <laughs> Name's uh, Sophie, or something. It doesn't come to church very often. Not that I blame her. Sounds like Sona. She's down here most market days. Haven't seen her lately, though. Bunch of folks suddenly not around much anymore. Best to not wonder about it. They say that he who seeks what doesn't concern him finds what doesn't please him.
Asuna, yes. It happened last night. The penitent ones arrested her on suspicion of heresy. They've been hunting for someone, rounding people up for days to interrogate them. They have a house they've taken over, near the center of town. You'll never get in, though. They guard it day and night. Osric's doing. The bastard has been stalking my every move. He's an Inquisitor captain. A real zealot can't be reasoned with. I've tried. Here's how we'll do this. Show this insignia to the guard. Tell them that you have an urgent message for their commander. Once you're in, hold their attention. Distract them however you can. I'll be right on your heels. Not in town. in town. Jilan? He looked too poor to pay. Yes, I was wrong. Not a bad piece either. Dirty, but no fake. Thanks, Wanderer. I shan't complain, save one ingredient, gutweed. It's a plant the drowned eat. Nothing like it for delaying necrosis. I don't know who discovered this, but it becomes more potent when partly digested by drowned. <laughs> yeah, I made the same face when I first heard it too. I recommend wearing gloves. Depends who's asking. For a foreigner like you, we're mercenaries. Payment up front. See, coin's hard to come by since the plague turned Chaldeum tits up. Since the plague, yes. Wiped out half the city before they tossed out the poor and us with them. All that wealth locked up to gather dust. Breaks my heart to see it. Coin still moves in Kegistan, but it's the bandit scum in Geakul pushing it. Blood money, that. <laughs> I was a street urchin once. Got into a bad deal. The wolves saved my hide. They raised me, kept me fed. And the job usually pays. So, for now, I stay.
Ordinary doll. Why didn't you say so? Well, it should look like me. It is me. I made this for someone. A child. Long ago. My child, perhaps? Yes. It was my child's. And she had one just like it that looked just like her, too. Fitting that this one has been carried back to me by the swarm after all this time. Maybe someday it will bring her back too. Ah, I'll be fine. Just wore myself out. Back in to visit my neighbors. <laughs> They've got it worse than me. Poor souls. Infected, forsaken. Left to wander the swamp until it takes them. Since you're here, help an old woman. Take these supplies to Baridan, Duraya, and Raldine. Treat them kindly, or the swamp will heal of it.
I'm... Yes? Yes, I'm still buried then. Thank you. And think him away for me. Without these herbs, the days pass like years. I'm so sorry. Don't be. This place can be rather peaceful once you get to know it. But enough of that. Duraya could use some comfort. Try the northwest. Can't say where Alden's got to. She says, I'll find my own herbs, thank you. Hear myself and leave this swamp for good. You can take that shite to Raldine, if he's still alive. Last I saw, he was headed east, towards the snakes. Best of luck. Somewhere. One of them mentioned the camp by the coast. If they took my brother. Don't worry. I'll look into it. What is this? Shouldn't be touching things like this. Do you even know what this is? Unbelievable. Do you have no sense? Well, 
Perhaps he didn't recognize it. Most don't bother to consider how someone like me becomes like this. Not until it's too late. It's easier to think it a punishment for some imagined problem or some other such nonsense. Those who believe that do so for their own comfort. To distance themselves. To say that this could never happen to them. That we are all just one little thing. One moment. One little red sprig away from home. Remember that, and you will always have compassion. And folk think we are monsters. There are men in this world who would take a dying boy, hack the source from his body, and sell them like herbs to the alchemists. But you've sated the swamp with their blood. You go now. Leave with our gratitude. How can I help? Don't ruin all that work. <laughs> 